Hey YouTube, Camper Van Kevin here. Well, today I am up at my local RV shop. Um, and when I pulled in to pick up some parts, I noticed one of these little U-Haul uh, campers. U-Haul had these available for rent, I believe it back in the early 80s, and they are ultra, ultra rare. So while I'm waiting for everybody to get here, I thought I might walk around it, show it to you, and show you the inside too. It doesn't have a price on it. I know it is for sale, so I'll uh, either tell you the price later or I'll put the price down in the description below. Now it's got the morning dew on it. And it's got mildew on it. But all in all, it seems like it's in really good shape. Very similar to the Casitas. Now, you tell how it's put together. This seam in the middle, it's got two halves that come together and it's got screws or somehow bonded here underneath this trim. Someone added an air conditioner, I guess the roof AC quit working. Now, that'd be a tough window to find. I guess you could have one made. I'm guessing it's either 10 or 12 feet. Small little tire, single axle. Yep. You haul. I guess a child could sleep there. Uh, now I'm 6'4, six, 6'5. Six, and I'm having to duck. But I can. That didn't make you dizzy. I can stand in here somewhat without shoes and no hat and ducking a little bit. There's the bed. I'm assuming somehow it makes a. Yeah, there's a dining table. I don't know much about these. Got your little kitchen sink. Someone added a microwave. No bathroom. Fire extinguisher. I always love to go in RVs and take a take a look around. So I figure you guys are the same way. Oh, there's a little fridge. Still got it. No, I don't know if I'll do this one hand. There we go. I don't know if that runs off propane or what. Hope that was in focus. This is all you need to go camping. So back in the, I guess, late 70s and early 80s, if you wanted to go camping, you could just go to U-Haul and rent you a little camper. A little furnace. Cushions are in great shape. All in all, for such an old camper, it's in really good shape. I guess this is a six foot ceiling. Just panning around more for you guys to, because I'm sure I'll miss something. Plastic, plastic liners. I don't know why the carpet's there. I guess it's to hide the seam. A little bench that makes a bed. I think this is probably six foot. No way to sleep in there for me. There you go. A U-Haul egg camper, towable, RV, what are we going to call it? Have you guys ever seen one where you're from or have you ever used one? I believe anything would tow it. I like it.
So again, I didn't know I'd be making this video this morning. Uh, it's at Town & Country Campers in Winterville, Georgia. Uh, they're on the net. They have a website. Uh, Pete is the owner. David is the technician here. It's something you're looking for. Condition-wise, it's dirty, but it looks solid. And look at the tires from here. It probably needs tires. Or will soon. So, something you're looking for, here it is. Hope you guys enjoy the video. We'll see you again soon. Talk to you later. Bye bye. Oh, tell them Camper Van Kevin sent you.